and it's now. Good morning, friends. We have just arrived in the port of Mazatlan, and we are getting ready to get off the ship and go on our tour. This time around, we are doing a, just like a city tour. They're gonna take us to different spots that are popular here in Mazatlan so that we can see what the city's all about. It's by land and by ocean. And by ocean, so we will see you guys soon. Hopefully we get to see some cliff divers. Yeah, I think we will. that the bus ride that we were on the windows were tinted and dirty so I'm not sure how well the videos are gonna come out on that trip hopefully they came out good hopefully it's just a built-in ND filter which makes it look better from ocean completely different uh, experience
I think they'll hit you. I think they're smarter than that. You ever seen the movie Birds? Here we are again, a second time coming to you from the streets of Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Vanessa in her natural habitat. Looking for the best deal. Searching. Just like, this is just like Peru. Yeah. If not, maybe worse. We literally had to dodge like three cars. Yeah, we almost got hit by a little like taxi looking thing. It was weird. Little mini cars, little power wheels. Oh, this is 
side of the road next to the port. So we have no idea if the guy's gonna be there or not. We're about to get dropped off back at the port at the entrance where the guy was the last time we were here. So future viewers, please pray. Pray real hard. <laughs> that we find this guy. That the ceviche cart is there because if every, it's not, we're gonna cry. Every ceviche we ever eat now, no matter well, where we go, it's always compared to that ceviche. None the of them the have ever lived up. There's Ever. a very important no, a monument oh. for the local Wish people. Wish us luck. By the name of... Te tomaste como tipo guachile? Fíjate, sí. Ok. Tengo ceviche. Yo tengo ya sea sí. en tostada o en tostita o en una horda. En tostada. Dos, por favor. Muy bien. They have found the ceviche. The only little cart that's here. Hoping it's in. Just things moving. That's it, right? That's it's it. so good. <laughs> Round two. <laughs> Round two. Seriously, if you guys ever come here, you have to have this ceviche. It's the absolute best. So, they've been in this, in this area for 40 years. Uh, this is the car that we were looking for. They used to be. Uh, right outside the cruise terminal, terminal. Right across the street, yeah. Now they're across the street. Yeah. I'm gonna put videos and links, and map directions, everything. If you guys ever come to Mazatlan on a cruise, you guys need to come yeah. to this place. All right, friends. The blue sign to enter the port, directly across the street, is where you're gonna find the little stand that will change the way you eat ceviche for the rest of your life. No ceviche compares to that. We've had a lot of different places, Belize, Peru. We've had other places in Mexico with the ceviche. My mama makes ceviche. And I'm sorry, mom, but this one tops every ceviche that we have ever had. And uh, you will not, or even if you don't like shrimp and fish, you don't taste it in there because the lemon and the salt and stuff that he puts in there, you, it's, it it's flavors so it good. So good. <laughs> Friends, you have to try it. You have to. You ever, have to. Ever in Mazalan, go to that stand right there. Right there. Change your life. <laughs> It looks like a turkey. Is gonna be it 
today guys we hope you enjoyed exploring the city of Mazatlan we know we definitely did it was uh we found the ceviche <laughs> and we found the ceviche y'all oh my gosh that was we were worried that he was that was the whole reason here. we came on this cruise let's yeah. be honest was to find that I'll ceviche I'll take the cruise just to come here to get the ceviche and um so we found it that was that made our trip but also seeing the city, um, getting to see how the locals live. Um, we enjoyed those types of things. So for us, it was a great tour. We booked it through Carnival. We got to enjoy the city all day, see lots of different things. So definitely recommend it if you ever do a cruise with Carnival. The last time we were out here, we didn't see the city at all. We got on a bus and went straight to the forest to do zip lining. Mm -hmm. And then that was all day long. Yeah. So we didn't see any of the stuff that we just seen today. Yeah. But that's going to be it for us today, guys. Uh, please go ahead and give that red button a loving little tap if you haven't done so already. Make sure you share our video with friends and family that love to travel or are planning on coming on a carnival cruise. And we will see you guys on the next one. Bye.